and food trailer owners are being forced to take extra precautions after several mobile businesses have been stolen this year. Ken's Fives Andrew Moore spoke to several victims today and Andrew keeping their trailer safe. It seems to be taking more than just a lock and key. Yeah, food truck thieves seem to be getting a lot more brazen and business owners typically say deterrents that they would normally use just are not working. So now they have to get more high tech. Woke up that next morning, you know, 100% convinced that I was ever going to see my trailer again. Mohammed Shadid parked his food trailer, called Lochmas, in a location with good lighting and great cameras. But that didn't stop these individuals from hauling the whole thing off in plain view, and Shadid said it was gutted for parts. They took pretty much everything, even like the small stuff, down to like the sprinkles. And back in February, this Build-A-Burger trailer was also stolen. Owner Julia Valdez says she had everything locked up but the kitchen sink. Four chains, about 10 locks, um, with, there was we took the wheels off and it wasn't enough they just drove it off with no tires they scraped the ground all the way valdez says her trailer was later sold on offer up and someone got swindled now with locks not working owners say high-tech gps systems are the next step it alerts you in real time that uh, you know the trailer is moving or i'd put two trackers um one inside of uh, you know, a wall somewhere that's hard to get to. And they're now warning others in the food truck game, make that investment now before it's too late. If you are a food truck owner, I suggest you, um, you know, be more diligent. And police told us today it's not uncommon for thieves to steal these food trailers and then resell them. Both food truck owners are trying to get back on their feet right now. You can find out how you can help them at kins5.com after this news game. Hope they can do that quickly. Thanks, Andrew.